The campaign under the theme Orange the World, Hear Me Too, was jointly opened by the United Nations and YCDC for the elimination of violence against women in Yangon on Sunday. From 25th November, the International Day for the Elimination of Violence Against Women, to 10th December, Human Rights Day, 16 Days of Activism Against Gender-Based Violence Campaign, is a time to galvanize action to end violence against women and girls around the world. The international campaign originated from the first Women's Global Leadership Institute, coordinated by the Center for Women's Global Leadership in 1991. The problem is that all over the world and also in Myanmar, we have not made as progress as legal right on violence against women and it's still a big problem we need to increase our efforts to try to combat, said Knut Cosby from UN. This is a global campaign, so I think events like this uh, is happening all over the world in many different ways, uh, but Orange is the symbol of trying to combat violence against women. We have this global convention to end all kinds of violence against women, which Myanmar is a, is a part of, and uh, gender equality and combating violence against women has been built into the global sustainable development goals. Everyone needs to make an effort, and every single organization needs to make an effort to combat violence against women. About one in three women experiences violence in their lifetime, and that's not acceptable. So in Myanmar, the policymakers have been working for a long time on a law to prevent violence against women. And, the, and that has been a very important effort. Now the law is in Parliament for the Parliament to process and approve, and I urge the parliamentarians to give this uh, the highest priority. Turn on the orange light on the City Hall of Yango, and this light will be on to remind that to all take part at the campaign to end violence against women. We also encourage the campaign so we turn on the orange light in the City Hall of Yangon to remind the making effort for end violence against women. We will light on to the International Day of Human Rights on December. According to figures of UN when in three women and girls experience physical and sexual violence in their lifetime, most frequently by an intimate partner, one in two women killed worldwide were killed by their partners or family in 2012, while only one out of 20 men were killed under a similar circumstance, and 71% of all human trafficking victims worldwide are women and girls, and three out of four of these women and girls are sexually exploited. 